Search from UC San Diego and other institutions shows wildfires are not just impacting burn areas. They're also causing aquatic ecosystems to also change. Fox 5's Alani Latang live for us in Torrey Pines with uh, more on this study and what it all means. Alani. Andrew, good evening and really an incredible study and something new that we're now seeing. So what this study does is explores the relationship between wildfire impacts and how it impacts um, the, the CO2 levels that are found in freshwater aquatic ecosystems. Now scientists say that uh, freshwater ecosystems are important because of the CO2 that it carries and also releases back into the environment and scientists say this is critical to study as they learn more more about climate change. When we think about climate change, it's really it's a CO2 math problem. In a new research study, UC San Diego researchers, along with other institutes, tested how wildfires impact freshwater aquatic ecosystems. The study measured how carbon dioxide is stored and released from the ecosystems should wildfire debris enter reservoirs, lakes, or ponds. UCSD postdoctoral researcher and lead author on the study, Dr. Chris Wall. It helps us understand more about how climate change is going to be impacting uh, the, the planet, but also in these local reservoirs that are important for that balance of carbon. For the study, researchers added varying amounts of burned and unburned sage and willow plants inside 30 experimental ponds. The ponds had fresh water with plankton from a nearby reservoir. The study took place over 90 days with researchers testing four times. They found with smaller amounts of burn material, more carbon is stored rather than released. But adding more burn material. We saw much more export to the atmosphere, which suggests that if burn material in high amounts reaches aquatic systems, it may re release a lot of that CO2 back into the atmosphere, which could you know, accelerate climate warming. Wall says with wildfires on the rise due to climate change, this latest study can help the population think about ways to limit some of the debris from reaching small bodies of water. So it's a real big problem. We're only really starting to understand how to uh, to address this and sort of what the feedbacks might be for for climate change or for ecosystem health or for the services that humans enjoy. Researchers say they're looking to extend this study and look at how um, wildfire and wildfire debris has impact on ocean life ecosystems. And if you'd like to read the full report and more about the freshwater aquatic ecosystems, head to our website at fox5sandiego.com. Reporting live in Torrey Pines, I'm Alani Latang, Fox 5 News. All right, important information certainly for all of us. Alani, uh, thank you so much.